Mic check. Perfect. All right. Um, this might be an interesting stream. Um, probably be doing this for about an hour and a half. Give or take five or ten minutes. Uh, the only issue being I'm currently taking care of... Um, my dog is on, like, bed rest right now. Uh, so, may end up ending earlier than that if it just gets to be too difficult to handle her at the same time. Anyway. So I, I think I was saying I was going to head north to Markarth uh, and do Strom's journal. There's a bunch of stuff that's burned over here. Oh, dragon attack. Probably. Yeah. Oh, you can actually get burned? You can! Look at that! Amazing. And they were just hauling a little bit of gold and some hide bracers. Sad. That's oh. definitely a dragon attack. <sighs> but essentially, we just have to kind of like hug the <laughs> the western mountains here as we go. just kind of go northwest until we get to Markarth. <laughs> what is this? Part of Collapsed Tower? Is that up there, probably? Oh, did it fall on this this elk? Nah, that elk was probably killed by those, uh... Those wolves. Oh, a troll. I was wondering what the red dot was for. Put fire breath back on and, uh... Well, regular trolls aren't too difficult anymore. Frost trolls are still, um... You know, a little bit stronger than them, but... Normal trolls go down pretty fast. That was like what five overcharged, like five double, uh, double flame bolts. Not too bad at all.
Is this a mine that's been overrun by bandits or something, or is it just a regular mine? Looks like the first one, the first assumption was right. Oof. Dude really put the smackdown on him. Bile Gulch Mine. You had a bow or are you just kinda... No, he doesn't have a bow. He's running away, which is weird. Eh, somewhere in here. We'll, we'll guess here. Hey, that worked. <laughs> I didn't think he'd run away. Maybe he was grabbing a friend? You guys gotta try harder, I don't know. Do they at least have like a marauder or something on their team that can, you know, hurt me a little bit? What do we got? We got orcish stuff here? Okay, so this mine probably's got some orichalcum in it. Oh, there's a marauder! I wish I had the full three words for uh, unrelenting force right now. That'd be a fun... Fun little experiment to see how far this dude would fly. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna use one of these. I just got way too damn many of them. Oh, Lydia. Damn it. I wanted to do... I, I wanted to kill him all by my lonesome. See now. Now I want to put a. I know fast travel isn't available. I just want to put a freaking marker down. Can I not put? I guess I can't. telling me to go back this way. Yeah, that looks accurate. Oh, no, now it's telling me to go around this way. Which is odd. Okay, yeah, it's not taking me to my own marker here. I will have to figure out how to get back up there myself. The problem is my mount is all the way over there, and if I have to walk all the way to Markarth, I uh, suspect I may die before <laughs> before I get there. Probably not. It's not cold out really, and I have I think enough food, but it would just take so freaking long. Can I just get back there by coming up here and then going around? Oh, Lost Valley Redoubt. Okay.
Hey, don't bark, please. Barkin's for... Uh, not you. Stop. Yeah, sorry, my, uh... My dog, like, tweaked something in her back, potentially, or... Uh, not really sure, um... <laughs> but she's not doing well, so, um... We might not have her for much longer, if you get my meaning. Oh, I don't actually know if it's possible to get back up there then, because that's... Is it up the waterfall? Well, I guess I'm traveling to Markarth on foot then. Oh well. I guess it's not like crazy far, I just really have to travel along this river. Until I get to like reach Water Rock and then... Yeah, I guess I'll just do that then. There's Lydia. We got four swarms over here. What up, bud? Ah! Oh, they're they're both ravagers. I'm gonna die. I didn't realize. Uh, I guess they've. Oh right, I'm not wearing my I'm not wearing my heavy armor because I'm out of uh, I'm wearing the thieves guild armor because I was out of encumbrance. Slaughterfish eggs? Yep. That means there's... The ground just shook. The ground just shook, but there was no sound effect? That was weird. Like my controller vibrated, and the screen shook a little bit. Two Nern root right across from each other. Normally they're not that close. Alright, I think my dog is going to sleep, so we should be good. That's that's what I'm hoping she does for most of the day today. Oh Lydia, you made it down. <laughs> I mean, I was uh totally expecting you to. I should probably eat something though. Uh I don't need anything that... Yeah, those are all like 380, and I'm not that low on... Like, I, my hunger isn't that high yet. I don't need to... Is that a rock? That's a rock, not a crab. Ooh! <laughs> oh, thank you, game. That was beautiful. Slow mo <laughs> Slow motion. Uh, just a slow motion miss, you know. Yeah, whatever. I don't have any archery perks anyway, so... I don't have, like, the slow motion zoom in.
There's a crab. What? You want food? Can't tell if my dog wants food or not. Because I put some in front of her, but she's just kind of... Not doing anything with it. She's like nudging it around with her mouth, but not really. There's a dead goat on the other shore there. Oh! Huh. Guess that cave bear's just been, uh... Killing these poor defenseless animals. That is a huge crab. Turn back around? Oh, I guess that was a sneak attack. Huh. I don't know. I guess the bear's not coming back this way. Wait, did the bear kill the slaughterfish too? How does that work? Maybe they can actually uh, attack in water. Oh, it's the Khajiit Caravan! What's up, bear? Can you attack underwater? It doesn't look like it. The bear might be scared of me. I don't think I've, I've never seen this like behavior before. The bear is just constantly running. Is it gonna come on attack? There, there it is. I was, I was getting confused. Swing that like that thirty percent deficit or whatever it is for being hungry is crazy. I guess I will. I'll eat uh, just a piece of cooked beef. Yeah, that brings us all the way up, all the way up to well fed. That's why I don't like the ones that give you three eighty because it always seems like it's a waste. I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. Shrine of. Dibella. Oh, there's Lydia. Alright, well, looks like we're going over another waterfall. I mean, I don't have to. <laughs> uh, but I am still on the path, right? Yeah, we're heading toward Markarth very slowly. And eventually I'll get my mount back. What? Don't lie to me, game. Whatever, Lydia. Her name is pronounced Patrick. <laughs> You're not wrong. Her name apparently is pronounced push me out of the way when I'm trying to assassinate a goat in the butthole. There we go. Butthole goat shot. I guess it would be goat butthole shot, but... Yeah, whatever. Hey, a chest. I'm just finding... You find so much random stuff when you're not uh, fast traveling everywhere.
Looks like I've already read that one. A gold diamond ring. Oof. Somebody's actually probably going to be upset that that's missing. Rip to you, mud crab. All right, let's see. Let's see if I can get the uh, long range. Hey. Oh, it wasn't an instant kill. <laughs> Got the second shot though as it entered the water. Beautiful. Is that a Oh, that's a thief. He wants to fight. What up, thief? Right. Hey, buddy. Hand over your valuables or I'll gut you like a fish. Um Do I look like I have any money? <laughs> I love that that works. I'm wearing like a bunch of, well, I'm not wearing a bunch of nice armor, but I'm wearing a good amount of nice armor and like, I have weapons and stuff. And he's just like, nah, I guess you look like you're really poor. Must have spent all your money on all that stuff you have. That was on the money. Game, don't tell me, don't tell me that that was a miss. That was absolutely on the money. Where did he go? Excuse me, Mr. Krabs. Where are you at? Dang. Well, I tried. He's gone. <laughs> um. Oh, there's another one. Hey there, buckaroo. Yeah, that's what should have happened. Oh, we're tired. Shoot. Is that another dead slaughterfish, or is that alive? I I think it's dead. It's dead. Okay. <laughs> can these guys attack underwater? Okay. Mud crabs and slaughterfish, I think, are the only things that can attack in water. Oh, that was a... Mm, that was a good shot. Hey, an urn root. That's what we're looking for. Pew! Must suck to get killed by a spectral arrow. It's not even real. that I can see before I take off. Doesn't look like it. Now we're gonna veer west. And we're on an actual path, which means this probably actually does lead to Markarth. Is that another thief? That's a Vigilant of Stendar. No, that's Maik! Maik saw a mud crab the other day. Horrible creatures. Maik loves the people of Skyrim. Many interesting things they say to each other. Mike is tired now. Go bother somebody else. Okay. Yep, Mark Earth is this way. <laughs> oh, give me a sec. I'm gonna grab the, uh, grab more food for my dog. See if she's still hungry. You want that? Good puppy. Alright. I'll see if she wants any more of her actual dry food. But, uh, luckily, she's not as noisy as uh, the foster dog we have is while she's eating. 
my foster dog like gets in the bowl and just roots around in there and you can just hear it clanging constantly so if if she's eating while I'm playing I have to like mute my mic for like three minutes another egg why are there so many birds nests on the ground would have been interesting if uh, in the game you could find birds nests but you had to like knock them out of trees or something that would have been cool Alright, um, give me a couple of those. Kamehameha! Hey, I actually landed right next to him. There was a third one, wasn't there? Is he in the corner there? No, I thought there was three. Might be in the water somewhere. Oh wait, I have Detect Life as a spell. Hold up. I forgot. Well, I guess not. Okay. Well, we're, we are already to Markarth. So it really didn't take as long as I thought it was going to on foot. Because, you know, you kind of forget how small Skyrim actually is. It's supposed to be larger than this in actual lore. And in... Uh, what, Daggerfall, an arena, but... Where is it in? I don't remember if, that, if it's in arena, actually. Alright, so we're gonna go find Strom's Yornal. I guess, or maybe we should go to Whiterun and actually drop off all of our crap. Because uh, once we're in White Run, we can just take the carriage back to Markarth. Yeah, that's probably what we're gonna do. Traveling. Where do you want to go? I'd like to head to White Run, my good man. When I'm in White Run, I always visit the Guild of Reef. It never hurts to pay respects to Lady Kinnerith. Sorry, I had to sneeze a bunch. For some reason, I have allergies right now, despite there being, like, nothing in the air outside. I don't understand it. We are famished, and we are very, very tired, and very cold. feel better, but still peckish. And we've got a level up available. Which, what level are we? We're level 55, so... That means, uh... Next level up should be a stamina increase, I think. Do you? There we go. Let's get some speech points. I sure do love how this is the fastest way to get your speech up. You just have to get a... I have a six gold bounty. And then I go around and I ask the guards to uh, not worry about it. And that gets my speech up faster than all, all the sales that I've made... Um, or any other persuade or intimidation attempts, because there's just not as many. That's no mistake. You're all, all right, but you just watch yourself. Next time, I might not be so lenient. Wait, I know you. I know. That's no mistake. You're a wanted man. All right, but you just watch yourself. Next time, I might not be so lenient. I think I had a silver ingot on me, didn't I? Yeah. Spare a coin for a poor my favorite. Oh, thank you. Divine bless your kind heart.
All right, let's take a let's take an eight hour nap. Be like what one o'clock? Wish I could take an eight hour nap right now. I'm tired. All right, we have a perk point. We could put it in that. We could put it in that or that. We could do. What do I need to get fire spells more damage? 60. Must be 60 for each of those then. Um, okay. Restoration is almost high enough to get me the 50% faster magic regen. Which is gonna be nice. Um, new enchantments are 100% stronger. Is pretty baller. Uh, so is... The smithing, however, because the more things I can smith, the faster my smithing will increase. I might do that. In fact, I just did that. Three twenty, three twenty, and two ten. I am a nerd. I'm a big nerd. All right. Um. Let's store. That boy. Let's store. The mask of Clavicus Vile is 58 armor and the helmet is 62. But I don't even I don't even have the matching set perk, I don't think. So I can I could wear the mask. The warmth is a lot worse though. That's the only that's the biggest downside to it. So I am gonna store it. Um, store, or wait, no, hold on, whoops. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get out my, uh, my Mythic Dawn outfit, obviously. And that's what we're going to wear around town. And then we're going to store uh, all the stuff we don't need to be wearing right now. Um... Oh, is there not a Mythic Dawn hood? I guess there's not. That's weird. What hat should I wear, then? I guess I should wear, um... I mean, I should probably wear that, because it makes prices 10% better. <laughs> or is the, the Mask of Clavicus Vile is actually probably even better in that regard. Prices are, yeah, 20% better, so let's just do that, then. Hey, Alastor, it's going pretty good. Are you leaning on more destruction ability? Huh? No, I'm just... I mean, I'm I'm doing destruction, but it increases incredibly slowly, um, so it's not really a big deal either way. Um, I got so many ingredients on me, good lord. Um, uh, so we want the gold or the mo oh no. Nope. The Malachite, the Moonstone Ore. I don't get why it just reorganized some of the stuff while I was clicking on it. Uh, I am trying to get a bunch of stuff sold so that I can get back to uh, Markarth and do a thing there. I'm basically just trying to clear out my inventory once again. Because I have to do this constantly because of this mod. Uh, store that. They still got 
I've got so many things I could enchant still. There you go. That's a pretty good outfit. What's the best Discord server? I can't understand how you have that much weight. My character sits under 80 when traveling, so I'm confusion. Uh, I think just my armor is, like, 80. 37, uh, 43, uh, 49, uh, 61, and wherever the hell that is. 60, yeah, 68 pounds is, uh... Uh, I don't carry around ore with me while I'm traveling. The only thing I have in miscellaneous that actually weighs anything, I think, is lockpicks and so many... I have a bunch of soul gems. I probably have, like, 10 pounds of soul gems. Maybe not even that. Because um, I don't carry gems around with me, either. Gems in here for when I eventually decide to actually um, start making stuff with gems in them. But I just don't care about that right now. How do you hold a magic mace? By the handle, of course. Alright, wait, we're at 184 out of 205. Oh, I actually put that's 18 more pounds of crap I can lug around while I'm doing my, uh, my chores. Or that. Those are Lydia's arrows, so I'll give those back to her. Um, I might as well wear the Thieves Guild armor, if, if we're being honest. It's just 35, 35 extra <laughs> pounds of weight we could carry. How do you hold a magic mace with no pockets? Oh, I don't know. Are you the one we were talking about? Are we rolling? Yeah, yeah, we were talking about it would only, you, you wouldn't, like, I mean, obviously, the spine is a is a hefty little bastard. You'd have to swing it pretty fast, but. Uh, Lydia, you don't have any? Oh, she doesn't have any um ingredients on her. Well, I will take those from you, and I will take those from you. Oh, we can improve her, uh... We can improve her boots and her shield if we find two orcish ore. And give her her arrows back, too. Yeah, um, you hold a magic mace when you don't have any pockets because it's magic, so it actually doesn't matter. Go inside to Var Maidens. See what he's got. Welcome. We've got small weapon. Take a look. <sighs> All right, Buckaroo. What do you got for me? You got. F I don't need that many Corundum. <laughs> uh, we'll take that. We'll take your Ebony. We'll take your Iron. Your Lether. Your Malachite and your Moonstone. And I'm carrying too much to be able to run already. Good freaking god. Um. I probably only need like six corundum. Good. So what am I at? I'm at 269. Good god, man. Ebony. You know. It's the opposite of uh, the fleshy. Alright, um I guess I mean I could just take one of my potions of uh of carry weight, like Oh, those only give me 20. Do I have any that are more than that? <laughs> when you say it like that, it sounds like something else. I, I'm sure I don't know what you're talking about, sir. Well, we're going to go do some smithing, though, so we should put on our... Uh, weapons and armor can be improved to 20% better ring. Wait, do I have a... I have Whirlwind Sprint, don't I? That should help.
That is like 100 pounds of potions. No, I think it's like 30, probably. Which is still, you know, like 60 potions. I do need... I definitely need to get rid of them. The problem is the woman in town uh, runs out of money so... so dang fast. All right, woman. Sometimes you have a different stock than the guy inside. Do you today? You do! Look at that! 11 more ebony, 60... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Yeah! Uh, that's what I'm talking about. Don't forget to check inside the shop if you need anything. I will not check inside the shop. Oh, I need to, uh, trans... I need to start transmuting, too. Oh... Why do not... I, why, I don't know why I don't have that favorited. I use it every time I come back to town. Okay. Uh, jewelry. Uh, let's make some gold stuff. Do I have silver ingots too? I do. Um, I have eight. There we go. Uh, ebony. Um, we could make four of those. And an ebony dagger. Glass. Uh, we got... Oh, that takes moonstone, too. Okay. Uh, elven. We can do a battle axe. Yeah, we'll do that. Orcish. We don't want to use... We want to use all but two of the orcish. So if we do that and we do a dagger... Perfect. Because uh, then we can improve the stuff that Lydia is using. Bum, uh, bum, bum, bum. Nordic. We can make fi 15 of these before we... Oh, we, we're out of leather strips. Dang. Alright, hold up. Um... Have you met my father? Take a look. Nope. Sell that, sell that, sell all seven of those and that, and then we sell the ebony armor, and then we sell the glass armor. Oh, shoot, she's out of money. Damn it, woman. I just gave you that for such a good discount. <laughs> that must mean I gotta go back into the guy inside to uh, do that. Hold up. Glass armor. Glass armor looks cool in this too. It just doesn't look as cool because the realistic graphics, I think, well, the slightly more realistic graphics, took away from the stylized look of, uh, like, Oblivion, for instance. Um, I need to take that from you, and I need to take that from you, because we got to improve the shit you use, my guy. Ooh, legendary. Oh, I did it to the armor. Oh, son of a... <laughs> I'm dumb. I could waste a steel ingot on that, but that's just getting returned to somebody, so that would be dumb. I'm right behind you. Well, sorry, Lydia. I'm dumb. If Yorlin Greymane has an orcish uh, piece, I'll give it back to you, but uh, I messed up. That was back. And you can have that back. Okay, um, <laughs> that was dumb of me. You should, you should, yeah, that's good, Alistor, because he streams good stuff also. Let's get going, then. Why do I have seven viewers right now? Hello, all you people. I appreciate it. I'm just confused. It's 10 o'clock in the morning where I'm at. <laughs> oh, their gold is linked, but their stock isn't? Seriously? That's... Oh, that's big dumb. That's big dumb. I don't like that at all. Shoot. And you have, you have nothing that I would want to buy. Like, not even to disenchant, because I already have all of these enchantments. Shoot, man. Um, trying to play Skyrim with my ebony armor. I 
I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's what are you? Oh, is it? Is about? It's about me shouting, isn't it? He wouldn't say yeah, it's about me shouting. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Hmm. Yep. Angervund. Huh. Normally there aren't, uh... Ebony. That's right. You gotta say it right. It's Ebony armor. What do I need to improve the Mask of Clavicus Vial? Is that, is that Daedric? Is it a, uh, Daedra heart? This is going to go really slowly, isn't it? <laughs> um. Oh my god, I'm still 10 pounds over even taking that. I didn't... Apparently if I run too fast, I drop the armor. Why would I put it down? It's mine. Shut up, idiot. Nope. Ah. I meant to take that in with me. Everything's for take a look. Okay. Bellator has got a good amount of gold. So we can sell this glass armor to him. Oh, he can only buy one of them. Wow. Everything costs so much money. <laughs> I hate it. Well, what can I buy from you to make you have more money first? Iron ore. I like leather. I like lockpicks. I like soul gems. I'll buy your pelts and I'll turn them into leather. That still only gives you 300 gold to buy my stuff. Um... Oh, that's useless at this level. Um, <laughs> wow, 10 points of magic damage. That's almost good against, like, a crab. I, I, I just wish they had more money to buy stuff from me. Um, oh, I never put away my ingredients, too. That's part of the issue. Whoops. Oh, thank you for the uh, hydrate re redeem. I'll go, uh, I'll go grab a drink in a second here. <sighs> Bellathor, you make me sad. Because I wish... I, I, I need more money to be able to... Uh, do anything. Or you need more money, rather, for me to be able to do anything. Pickpocket success is 15% better? Yeah, I, I finally got around to adding um, timers on stuff so that people weren't just spamming. Because <laughs> I realized that that was really dumb. Uh, Alright, so we're gonna... I'm gonna sell... I'm gonna try and get these down to, like five max each oh god the ultimate stamina is so oh my god I can sell one of these down to five so one of these down to five and he's down to three gold okay the good news is we can sell a bunch of stuff to the potion lady because we're gonna buy all of the ingredients she has hoping that she has fire salt she probably doesn't because I swear to God, she only gets fire salts in like once every month. If not, what do you need? Ah, so you're an alchemist then. I am. You ask me this every time. It's like you have dementia. All right, she's got seven hundred gold. That's enough to buy like what two potions? All right, 
So those are the, the that's the nice potions. Where the where the stuff where's the stuff I don't want? Um I've never used the invisibility potions, but they're also really expensive, so I don't want to sell those first. Let's sell 20 points of magic is not going to do much to me at this point. Get that down to 5. Um 24% of resist poison. Honestly, I don't care. Oh my god, the ultimate are so expensive. I can sell one of these. I can sell two of these. And then she's basically out of money. I could give her my skooma. I could give her all of my skooma. Which is, I mean, that's three pounds. So that's, that's freeing up a good amount of weight. But... Alright, where did I drop that orcish armor? Right there? Okay. Oof. Can you imagine accidentally getting like a 35 pound piece of armor thrown at you? That shit just beans you in the head at like 20 miles an hour? Not be comfortable. Why does it just randomly drop it? I'm so confused. Maybe my issue was that I put on the mask of Clavicus Vile. I'm selling things too well. be praised. All right, at least this guy starts with 1,200, which is great. Oh my God, the single piece of orcish armor is worth more than that. I hate my life. I hate it. I. <laughs> oh my God. We'll give him the glass. We'll buy the dwarven from him. We'll buy the ebony from him. We'll buy the iron. The more iron, everything. Well, buy. Give me all of your shit, my dude. Uh, we could give. Well, Lydia. Lydia's only using Mayrun's razor now, actually, so she probably wouldn't even take the frickin' thing. I should make her ebony boots, though, while I'm thinking about it, actually, because she's got orcish boots on right now. Oh, he doesn't have a... I always forget. He, for some reason, he doesn't have an actual... Um, How can I serve you, my uh, a, a armor table up here. He has a he has a grind wheel, but no armor... I guess because he doesn't make armor for the companions, but... Yeah, so she's going to keep wearing the orcish boots until I can upgrade the ebony past... <laughs> whatever the orcish uh, stats are. Um, so, Lydia. I'm 60 pounds overweight, uh, both in real life and in the in-game's encumbrance. Um, can we... have you carry the orcish armor? Oh, is the, is the legendary orcish armor actually better than the ebony armor? 122, 158. Good God, it really is. Okay, uh, I guess I gotta get, I gotta get better at improving ebony. Oh, I just I'm I'm just I'm just messing around. I do it to entertain myself mostly. I I, I know how to say ebony. <laughs> Here, Lydia, can you carry all these ingredients? Well, that almost got us down to our uh, our limit here. You lead, I'll follow. Either way, we can make some more stuff. Uh, let's do some dwarfen. Uh, we have ten dwarven ingots, so we'll do three of those and a dagger. We have. Uh, Enough to do two of those and two daggers. 
Orcish, we are out of Oracalcum, Ebony, we have enough to do some... We just do some daggers? Two of those. Glass, we are out of Malachite. Uh, jewelry, I don't think we have... Yeah, nope. Um, Nordic, we have enough to do some... Oh man, I didn't realize... They only take one Quicksilver piece, but they take more steel than they take Quicksilver. That's dumb. Okay. Um, I guess I will make four daggers and then sell back the Quicksilver ingots? Question mark? Um, dwar we already did the Dwarven, right? Yeah. Uh, steel. And we just used all of our steel. Um, iron. Oh, I'm only 300, 318 pounds overweight. Just like in real life. Alright, well, while I'm very slowly walking toward um, <laughs> the other forge so that I can actually make stuff, I'm going to grab that hydrate. Because I can still kind of see the screen from where I'm at in, in the kitchen here. Excuse me. What's funny? I mean, a lot of things are funny, but in this context... Oh, shoot. Imagine just walking around and just saying your name at people. I move faster than this for like 120 pounds of it. Yep, this is how this is how we walk through town. You just start walking it and you just hear Well you can't tell by the way I use my walk, come on with me. No time to talk. I think that even the BG boys moved a little bit faster than this in the in the music video. Then why are you still in town if you don't have anything for me specifically? Oh, uh, that real. I need to um. stop. Good. Glad we straightened that out. Yeah, don't worry about it. I'll never, I'll never ever shout again. Oh, I forgot I haven't been using transmute. Oh, I'm so dumb. Uh oh, oh, he's coming toward me. He's trying to tell me to stop shouting. He's trying to do it again. <laughs> you can't stop me. Oh! That was. I'm really glad that that didn't just, like, kill me. Alright, um. I have enough to make some more leather stuff now, too. Uh... I need to... Good. It won't happen again! God, why do I keep getting talked to about this? Not like I keep shouting for no reason. I'm using it to travel around faster. Come on, man. Wrong one. Whoops. There we go. 
That's what I meant to do. Smithing is up to 87. That's what I'm talking about. Now, if only there was anyone in this town that could buy uh, 300 pounds worth of smithing goods. Because I think everyone is tapped out monetarily. I guess... I guess we're going back to the house and drop, transmute turns iron ore into silver ore, and it turns silver ore into gold ore. Uh, gold ore uh, is used to make uh, rings and such, which is a very quick way of increasing um, uh, smithing without having to have extra ingredients like leather strips, because all you need to make the rings or necklaces is just the ore, or, or just the ingots, nothing else. Okay, so actually let me find, I'll, I'll use a different chest to kind of denote that this is all stuff that just needs to be sold. Yeah, we'll just use this dresser. Um, so if we put in all of those, 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 that, and those, and those, and those, and that, 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 and that. Damn, man. Yep. Yeah, and if you have all three words of uh, of Whirlwind Sprint and you had, like, the Amulet of Talisan and then all your clothing uh, decreased shout regen time, you could actually get around... It wouldn't be normal speed, but it would be fairly quickly. Alright, um, and then... Moonstone ore... I didn't realize Quicksilver... They, ca they carry so many Quicksilver, but you need at least one steel for everything else that's Quicksilver, too. Which is annoying. Okay, uh, so what we're going to do now, then, is we still need to go... Excuse, whore, excuse me. There she goes, okay. I need to grab all the ingredients from you now, good sir. Why is this going so slowly? Like, it, it's going much more slowly than I'm actually tapping. Cool. Okay, we've got, oh, okay, we only need two more fire salts, which is good. Uh, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put on, um, the ring of created potions are 20% more powerful. And we're going to, we're going to just hop to it here, uh. We're gonna get our um, <laughs> we're gonna get our alchemy up as well. Holy shit, we did it! We finally got through like all of the skeever tails we had. I had like thirty-eight of them for so long.
That was odd. Uh... Trying to do this very carefully so that I don't use uh, any fire salts. Okay. So we just use. Uh, how much weight are we at now? Oh wow, that actually it only added like forty pounds to us. That's not bad. Actually, you know what? I could probably just keep the, um, I could probably keep the fire salts on me and just give them to Lydia to carry for whenever we go to Riften, as long, all we have to do is find two more, and that'll save a trip back to Whiterun. Still here. I am at your command. Yeah, if you want to take, oops, uh, those from me, uh, thank you very much. You know what, I'm actually kind of worried that she'll use them for some reason. I don't know why, but I've had her use potions. It's, she probably wouldn't. <sighs> Either way. Um, I guess I just gotta store the uh, ebony armor and the ebony boots until I'm uh, good enough at smithing to make them better than the orcish, because right now there's a 30, 30 point deficit. 36 point deficit between the two. Um, let's store all the potions that we don't need because we can't sell them because nobody in town has money. Um, so I'm going to keep... I'll keep some of the good damage health with me. I'm going to store that bad one. Um, th that is worth 400 gold. Good God. Um, that's really not that much stamina. The stamina regen ones are useful, but I definitely don't need 12 of them. Let's store all three of those and then store all but five of those. Um, 70 points of magic over 10 seconds? That's not... It's not that much. Because they... All the guys who use magic are always wearing clothing that raises their regen rate anyway. 18 points is not good. Um, that's not really good compared to some of the other ones I have. I got two potions of cure disease. I'll keep one on me, and hopefully I won't need more than one. Fortify destruction, but it also poisons me. No thank you. I don't really give a shit about fortifying heavy armor. Um, bum, 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 bum. No. No. I have I have so many actual uh I have so many stamina potions, I don't need oh good god. You know, I'm only gonna carry like three of the ultimates with me. Because I have so many of the other ones. Same with same with the Vigorous. I'm only going to carry a couple of those. Okay, that should help. <laughs> that should definitely help the carry weight ish issue. Alright. The only other thing we really have to do now is um, go enchant some rings. Which, to do that, we will switch over to... Uh, Oh, I thought I had a, um, I thought I had a ring of enchantment. I guess I don't. I guess I should make one. We'll have to make a ring of enchantment then. Um, and so we can actually get most of our stuff back here. I will equip that. I will take that. I will take that and that and that and that. And I'm over encumbered again. Kill me. Alright, 
let's go up to uh, Dragon's Reach. Shut up, Mila. You're a child. Wait. I know you. Uh-uh. It's no mistake. All right. But you just watch your Yeah. It's, it's really weird that uh, begging guards not to arrest me is the fastest way to increase speech. <sighs> Wait, there's no mistake. You're all right, but you just watch your turn. I love how I could also pay him 700 gold to ignore me when my bounty is six. It is six gold. It's kind of great. Okay. So let's make a ring of enchantment. Um, do I actually have one is a good question, though. <gasps> I don't have fortify enchantment. Well, that must be the issue, then. Shoot. Huh. Never mind, then. Um... See, this is actually... I think this is the one that takes the longest. Because <laughs> they have to... It, it won't... Uh, it doesn't stay highlighted, even though you, you'll be using the exact same things, which is kind of weird. Whereas for everything else, it does. Yeah, there's, if there's enough to keep... Uh, to, to continue making something, it uh, stays highlighted for alchemy or for... Um, or smithing or whatever, but yeah, no, not for enchanting for some reason. I don't know why this one is different from the other skills. Hey, and this will this looks like it's gonna get us up to uh, another level up too. Yep. There we go. Two level ups in town. That is what I like to see. And now I'm out of I'm out of rings, right? I mean, I have more back in the house, but I'm not going to Yep. I'm not going to leave and come back. Those it just takes too long. Take a look. I've already been in town for like 30 minutes at this point. <laughs> All right, Ferengar, you can buy, what, five rings from me? A couple more than five. All right, now we need to, whoops, now we need to buy some stuff from you to re, re, uh, re-up. That should be good. Yeah, okay. Well, that uh, that went pretty well. You know, if you've got the and what is our enchantment? It's 88 now? 88, man. If, uh... Enchanting might be the next thing I actually get to 100 then. Because I've gotten, I've gotten Illusion to 100 twice already, and it's already back up to, I think, what is it, in the 70s or 60s or something? Because Illusion, you don't actually have to have um, anything to cast it on. You can just cast it. That's why it increases faster than everything Wait. else. I know you. You do. There's no mistake. All right. You just watch yourself. Next time I might not be so what is your good news, Alastor? I like good news.
The courier is still just standing there. What a psycho. Um... Gold ore added. How many... How many of these things do I have left? I've got one iron ore, and am I out of silver? I'm out of silver. Okay, cool. Nope. Sorry. So I only need to cast it one more time. Or two two more times to turn the iron into iron into gold. There's one. Come on. There's two. Double checking. Yep, the only ore I have left is gold. Let's get a little bit more smithing experience. And we're halfway. I gotta be <laughs> first time yesterday. I, yeah, I guess that's good news. <laughs> Little, little TMI. <laughs> All right, um, we're gonna put these rings back. We're gonna put our. Um, I'm gonna store those in there until I'm like, uh, what king of the magic. Um, and we're going to put on, we'll put on our one-handed one. Alright, time to put back um, the Mask of Clavicus Vial, the Mythic Dawn stuff. We're going to put the armor back on. That gives us 33 pounds of weight. Which ain't too bad. That's enough to finagle around with. Potions, we, we probably could store some. I'm going to start... I, I Like, I use poisons often enough. Let me just make sure I put another one on, because that'll save me half a pound of weight. Because it doesn't weigh half a pound anymore um, when it's on the weapon. Oh, have yeah, have a good day at school, Alistor. Thanks for stopping in. I appreciate it. Congratulations. <laughs> Um, all right. Oh, and we store the gold ore as well, because that's a whole pound we save. Got some stones of Barnzaya. And did I take the stuff off of Lydia? I don't remember. I am sworn to carry your burdens. I did not. She'd rather wear the orcish until I am until I'm good enough at smithing to improve the ebony. To a to a to a uh, better level than the orcish. I am sworn to carry your burdens. Um, she also has fifteen pounds of arrows on her. We could probably store. Let's store like fifty of these ebony arrows, man. You have 50 of each? That ain't too bad. Um, so she doesn't use her greatsword either anymore. Anyway, she just uses the Mayrune's razor and the bow. Oh, and the Staff of Fire. Yeah, let's, let's take that and store all that too. Everybody's got extra weight on them. Everybody's happy. Or extra weight off of them. Extra carrying capacity is what I mean. <laughs> okay. Um, bu -bu 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 -bum. The only other thing I think we need to do is summon our crab. Because I don't know if he has stuff on him. I don't remember, to be honest. Where'd he go? I hear him. Ah, there he is. He just had... Oh, that's right. I was just going to keep the uh, dragon priest masks on him. So he has... Croesus and the Wooden Mask. Okay. So then we just gotta eat and sleep. Or we'll sleep and then eat. I've got about 20 minutes before I have to get offline. 
and uh, go to work, unfortunately. Putting points back into that. Smithing, we are almost to 90, which is what we need for Daedric. Which will be pretty freaking sweet. Um, we could put a point into... Uh, what's our one-handed at? Oh, we're at 85. We're almost high enough to start putting points back into one-handed. Because once I have 90, then we put Bonebreaker 3 in, and maces just ignore 75% of armor, which is uh, the best. Um, I guess I could put them in... I could just put them in the one that does more damage, but I, I'm not... I've gotten lockpicking to 80 without a single perk. I've gotten sneak to 62 without a perk. Uh, speech, we're almost at 70... Which is, Intimidation is twice as successful. That's pretty good. What are the rest of these? Any type of item to any type of merchant uh, can invest 500 gold with the shopkeeper. That's actually pretty good. Maybe we should put points in this so we can start getting there. And then Master Trader <laughs> is everyone gets an extra 1,000 gold. Shoot. I don't have enough perks to... Uh... Oh! Thank you for the subscription, Gilly's Note. Thank you for subscribing at Tier 1. Hell yeah, you've been subscribed for Doso Monthso, which is uh, German for two months. I guess I could I could put man, I just don't have enough perk points. I just I I want more. Um I guess for now we'll just put it into either enchanting I don't yeah, I can't put it into smithing. So either enchanting or heavy armor. If I do that, that's maxed out um, for the first perk of enchantment. Or um, I can bring my heavy armor up to... Oh, I need one more rank anyway to get it to 80%. Never mind. Um, the only other one that I might be interested in is block, but I don't do a ton of blocking. Like, it's up to 60, which is not bad, but... I guess I could put it in shock spells do an extra 25% damage. We got to vote for heavy armor. All right, I'll put it in heavy armor. If I can. Or oh no, I need one more I need one more point. The only one I could do fists of steel, but I don't really care about that. Um I'll just save my perk point for now. Why the hell not? All right, let's stock up on food before we leave. Didn't realize I still had a piece of bread in the house. And what is our, our actual level of encumbrance now is 171. So we get yeah, 34 pounds. That ain't too bad. Ain't too bad at all. We're almost up to level 60. I enjoy this work well enough, but I'm ready to retire. I've been thinking of selling the into Isolda. What can I get you? Let's you should sell the into Isolda then. She's good at what she does, man. Uh, grab some baked taters. We'll grab, um... We got one salt on you, so from that we could do... We could make apple cabbage stew or whatever it is, I think. Yeah. Oh, we need a red apple to do that. No, who cares? Never mind then. <laughs> okay, well. We can finally get out of this uh, out of this town. Travel by carriage to Markarth. 360 Wait, speech scope. I know you. That's no mistake. You're a one. All right, but you just watch yourself. <laughs> Speech increased to sixty-nine. Wait, I know you. That's no mistake. You're a one. I should just get. Uh, you know, you're not worth the hassle. 
I should get a six gold bounty in every hold so that I can just uh, do this everywhere I go. It's very clearly the fastest way to get speech up, so... Can we see the back of the map? Oh, no, we can't. That's one of the only things you can't spin all the way around. Good sir, take me all the way to Markarth. I don't know why that's only 20 gold. It seems like it's farther than, like, Solitude is, but... That map, and there's a loading screen with the dark... Oh, yeah, the door. Yep, you're right. You are right. Forgot about that one. We are drained, we are famished, but we are in Markarth. Oof. Yeah, dude, there's like there's like two inches of snow on the ground right now. Like it's almost nothing, and people were driving uh I swear to God, like 15 miles an hour in in two inches of snow. And I'm not even, like, mad. I'm not mad about the small cars that are doing it. I'm not mad about, you know, the dude who's in the frickin' 2002 Toyota Camry driving 15 miles an hour. But I was passing people in F-250s and, uh, and like, full-size SUVs. Like, what are you doing? Two of our city cops going the speed limit, and they looked at me like, Dude, I, I don't understand, like... It's like every winter, everyone just forgets how to drive. I'm sure my... Did you hear? The Hall of the Dead is closed. Brother Varalis isn't... Degain the beggar got himself kicked out of the Temple of Debella. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Take a look. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. I... Uh... It, it it straight up just confuses me, man. Like, I've lived in Michigan my entire life. After, like, two winters, I was fine to drive at the speed limit in, in low amounts of snow. I would say, like, sub four inches, I still go the speed limit in almost all cases unless I know there's ice. But there's no ice. It's, like, the first actual snow we've had in weeks. I... People, man. People. They don't know how to drive. <laughs> Alright, we awaken feeling refreshed. Let's eat that kebab. No, let's eat the heavy stuff. The horker loaf weighs a whole pound. The leg of goat roast weighs a whole pound. Better but still peckish. Let's eat the baked potatoes that only give 18. And the bread. And... Yeah, and we'll save everything else. Cool. Let me know if there's anything else. My favorite drink. My sand buggy, I just floor it in the abandoned parking lot. It would be nice because well, and yeah, and that's. <laughs> I feel like part of the problem is, you know, nobody, no one buys snow tires, not even here where you're uh, really supposed to. I just have, I mean, I have, um, pe most people don't even buy all weather tires, which is what I have, which, you know, they're kind of like, they're like three fourths as good, I would say. Um, I don't know, man. And it, it's probably just the same people that are bad at driving when it's not snowing, <laughs> you know? 
but there's multiple times where uh, both lanes of traffic were blocked by people that were going like 15 miles an hour and I was like, what do you if you're gonna be driving really slowly, that's what the right lane is for so now we've got to find Strom's journal I don't even remember Sand buggies are cool also. I was playing DayZ. Do you know what that is? I do know what DayZ is. Um, I just saw that comment. Sorry. Um, I have played it... I played it for like 15 minutes. My issue was I didn't really want to play it by myself. Like, I I, uh, I downloaded it because it's free um, on Game Pass. I was like, okay, cool. And then I, I was just wandering around by myself, and I was like, I don't really know anything that's going on. I don't have anyone to show me the ropes. So I'm just going to kind of, eh, you know. Oh. Shoot. Good hit, Lydia. Learning to drive, and my mom let me go to the store down the road. I am underage to drive. Saw a dude doing 15 miles an hour, like half an inch. Yeah, like it's it, mm. like if there is actually ice, it can obviously be a problem. I I'm not saying like I'm not a uh, you know. Oh, are you immune to coming back to life, good sir? Apparently, you are. I'm not, I'm not saying that you should drive fast on ice, but, like... Oh my god, I keep forgetting that I haven't put fire breath back on, and I just jumped into the middle of them like a dipshit. Oh, okay, well... Oh, I bet the big one respawned. A different breed of people. Walked for like two hours and I finally got to this town. I was headed for just a few minutes ago. I made the entire walk from my camp. Forgot my storage bag to get food. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> oh. Not only did it respawn, but it's not even like it's pretending that it's, um... It, it still has the unique name. That's actually super weird. Oh! <sighs> Lydia, you... <laughs> oh god, I love Mayroon's Razor. Well, that was easy. She just one-shot it. She just ran up, poked him in the eye, and he died. Absolutely beautiful. Don't drive fast on ice. Absolutely. Don't, well, yeah, don't drive fast on ice because you can't slow down, you can't turn. It's, it's, yeah, it's, it's bad. It's bad news. Black ice is, uh, a no bueno. Are there, oh, shit. We're down here with Fal, uh, Falmer? I didn't realize... This is the first time we fought them, so I actually don't know how strong they're going to be on this difficulty. Um, and I know they're blind, so I'm going to see... I know well, Lydia will trigger them because her sneak is awful. But I'm going to see how slowly I can sneak by them. Ooh. Okay, bud. Um... Can you can you soul trap these guys or do they technically count as people? Cuz I mean they are like technically people. Okay, you can soul trap them. 
Quicksilver Ore. Weak Poison. Okay. Excuse me. Thought you were talking about real life for a second, not Daisy. Oh, <laughs> yeah. For walking two hours in the snow. Lydia, why are you... And... Oh, he didn't die. He didn't even come close to dying. I don't even know if he took damage. He might have fallen in the water. Oh, I should start using poisons, too. Because if they're going to use them, I should do it, too. From whence? Oh shit! I'm sorry. That hit my shield and it still killed me, despite me having the perk that's supposed to make me not take any damage from that. I love how Bethesda hasn't fixed that perk in ten years. Gotta love it, man. He went right for me. All the noise around him, and he just... Man. Single-minded dude, huh? Didn't mean to grab his war axe. What what trap is being triggered? I don't even see anything. Whatever. Okay, these guys really have a lot of health. Hey, that did a lot of damage. Do your worst. I like gold ore. Can I poison the bound bow or no? Because it's a... Alright. Well, I like that. Why, why write for me? I'm not the one making all the noise. You, you people, you are just biased against uh, Argonians, aren't you? Don't know where the guy I just summoned went. Oh, but I got hit in the center of the forehead with an arrow. 
All right. Thalmer are really tough still. At level 60, basically. That's crazy to me. Um, so I might, act, I, I might not actually do this uh, quest now. Then I might come back to this. I didn't realize um, like the base level Falmer were going to give me this much freaking trouble on this difficulty. <laughs> uh, either way. Um, I mean, I, I might. I don't know. Oh, not load. Good God. Uh, I'll do a full save here. Uh, I have to get off and go to work, though. Uh, thank you to everyone who watched. Thank you for the subscription from Gilly's Note, I think it was. Um, thank you for being subscribed for two months. I appreciate it. Uh, thank you to everybody who's been in the chat. And uh, I hope you guys all have a good day. And I'll, uh, I'll, I'll catch you in the next one, hopefully. Whenever that happens to be.